Drones operated by Ukraine's defense forces attacked the Borisoglebsk military airfield in Russia's Voronezh Oblast on the night of 2-3 October. Source in the security service of Ukraine said this to Ukrainska Pravda. The source reported that drones from the security service of Ukraine, special operations forces, and other branches of Ukraine's defense forces struck warehouses containing guided aerial bombs, parking areas for SU-35 and SU-34 warplanes, and aviation fuel storage sites overnight. The Russians have been using this airfield to launch frequent guided aerial bomb attacks on Ukrainian territory. Posts emerged on Russian social media at night about air defense operations, flights by a large number of drones, and loud explosions and a fire near the local airfield. Satellite monitoring recorded four fires on the territory of Borisoglebsk. Recently, the Ukrainian armed forces struck a warehouse with Iranian missiles. According to the general staff of the Ukrainian armed forces, before the strike on the warehouse, an important echelon arrived at the facility. In addition, the Ukrainian armed forces knocked out hundreds of targets on the territory of the Russian Federation. Ukrainian forces are withdrawing from the frontline town of Volodar, perched atop a tactically significant hill in eastern Ukraine, after more than two years of grinding battle, military officials said Wednesday. Volodar, a town Ukrainian forces fought tooth and nail to keep, is the latest urban settlement to fall to the Russians. It follows a vicious summer campaign along the eastern front that saw Kiev cede several thousand square kilometers, square miles, of territory. Ukraine's Kortitsia ground forces formation, which commands eastern regions including Donetsk, said in a statement posted on Telegram it was withdrawing troops from Volodar to protect the military personnel and equipment. In an attempt to take control of the city at any cost, reserves were directed to carry out flanking attacks, which exhausted the defense of the units of the armed forces of Ukraine. As a result of the enemy's actions, there arose a threat of encircling the city, the statement said. The tactical significance of the town, situated at the confluence of two major roads, is twofold. Dominant heights and proximity to railway lines offer Moscow greater protection for their own logistics routes, and a better vantage point for attacks against Ukrainian forces and supply lines feeding the south. Its capture is another notch in Moscow's belt, bringing it closer to the key logistics hub of Pokrovsk.
Це вони в самому місці, да, залітають, в принципі, можуть літати. 